Okay, y'all, so I did a coat change. I think this is better. Oh, y'all. Travel with me as I go along my little evening. It's feeling like a cocktail night. Hmm. What does my palate have a taste for this evening? Hmm, I don't know, y'all. What we want to drink this evening? I need to eat before I drink anything. It's a little nippy out here today. It was warmer yesterday. It's supposed to be 50 tomorrow, though, so hey. Happy Super Bowl. Yeah, see, that's why I don't come this way. This why I don't. Every time I try, it makes me remember. No, don't come this way. Hmm. Look, nippy out here. Y'all, I really gotta lose some weight, y'all. I gotta get this 10, 20 pounds up on me. Maybe 30. Y'all, I want to try, like the coat I had on, it wouldn't button. Then I tried my other little jacket on, little blazer jacket. It wouldn't button. Uh, then I was trying my trench black on. It buttoned and it fit. It just didn't pop. You know what I'm saying? I got on all black, basically. So I needed something to make it pop. So thank God this still fit. And this is an antique, you guys. I want to show y'all what it really looked like. It's a nice-ass coat. Every time I wear this coat, I get all kinds of compliments on it. And people will be like, where do you get it from? I want one. Baby, you might won't get one similar, but unfortunately, this was my grandmother's coat. And this came from William H. Lewis. It was a um, a, a pretty well-known store when I was growing up. Uh, I got one of her pea coats, red, a red pea coat. Nothing like the pea coats they came out with. Honey, my grandmama had some stuff, and I got my hands on it. I got all kind of antique jewelry that she had, y'all. And I don't really wear it no more. I used to wear it often. But it's so nice. I don't want nothing to happen to it, so I don't often wear it. I got all her antique uh, jewelry boxes, all that stuff. Most of her earrings are clip-ons, though, so I don't... I don't... Um, what clip-ons hurt, so I don't fool with them too much. But she has some nice pieces. And my mother always say, girl, you just like your grandmama, and... I used to didn't understand, but she said everything that you wear, your grandma used to wear. And then she like, this was your grandmama coat. And, and she like, girl, I wouldn't even thought you liked that. I love it. And it seems like people do too. Come on, y'all. This is ridiculous. Now, nah, God dang. I'm sorry, but I'm about to go through the gas station. I'm not going to sit here and wait no more because these folks act like they don't know how to go. Green mean go. As the little boy on my bus say, green man, go. <laughs> that that light, as soon as that light turn green, baby, he be like, green man, go. He don't, he don't want you to wait on the people in front of you or nothing. Just take your foot off the gas, break and hit the gas. <laughs> like right now, y'all, I got to ride. I got to go backwards and go to this Western Union and send off this money. And then I'll be headed to the home going service. Because I am a very punctual person. At least I try to be. And I told my cousin I'd meet her there by 5. So that's the plan to go. Try to meet her there by 5. Hopefully it's not a line in here. Hopefully the computers aren't down. I did look online and see that I could actually probably send this online through Western Union. But I really... I didn't feel like playing with it to figure it out. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to just go right here and make sure that it's sent and make sure that it's um, protected and no mishaps or whatever. <clears throat> y'all, me and this hair, though, it's long. I know I'll do this long, long hair, y'all. So. And this wig ain't glued on. Y'all, I tell y'all something. I didn't even pin this unit or nothing. I feel so un... Damn, like a scooter. I feel so un unprotected. I just, it's like, oh, Jesus. Oh, Lord. 
Don't let this be a day a bitch get froggy. She want to pull the wig. Y'all, you want to see my attitude change? Let a motherfucker fuck with my hair. Try to embarrass me. Because I don't get embarrassed. But the fact that you try it. Pull my hair. I'm going to feel like you hating on me. And then all that good energy I got. Oh, Lord. It's still going to be good energy. Why I fuck you up. Pull my hair. That's like when I was young. We could fight all we wanted to. Don't pull my hair. Don't try to scratch my face. Because a bitch going to go ballistic on you. Because then I'm going to feel like, oh, you not mad at me about that. You mad at this. You know what I'm saying? I'm just an ordinary little chick. I ain't doing nothing that don't nobody else do. I wear wigs. I throw up on. I don't even know how to do makeup. I just do what I know how to do. Throw on me an outfit and keep it moving. That's all I've ever done. When you try to scratch my face and pull my hair and shit like that, then I feel like that's jealousy. Because a fight, you just bow. You know what I'm saying? You straight hitting motherfuckers. You ain't trying to scratch nobody, pull their hair for what? I'm trying to damage your face. Well, not real. Yeah, I am. I'm punching you in your motherfucking shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just want you to have a big ass lip. I'm not even trying to block your motherfucking eyes, but I do want you to shut the fuck up. So I'm going to bust your lip. I'm going to fuck your gut up. I'm going to hit you in your body, body shots. You know what I'm saying? That's just me, though. Well, that was me, but let a bitch pull my hair out of that. And this motherfucker come off. Bitch, you can have it. You can have it. And take what come along with it. Let me quit, y'all. Let me get up out of here. Let me go ahead. Let me go ahead. Get in here, y'all. Why it wasn't nobody up in here. And get on down here to this service, y'all. I'll be back, all right? I'm going to put y'all on hold.